Hey guys, it's Will from Galactic Bonesman, and today we're gonna I'm gonna be teaching you how to make a, one of these cannon things. Um, so before I start this or anything, I just like to say that this idea is not mine, but this design is. And this idea came from this guy named Last Stand Gamers. If you don't know him, his name's Aaron, I think. It's pretty cool. I watch him all the time just because he's awesome. Um, yeah, he basically taught me how to make this. So if you'd like to learn how to make one of these, you've seen it on a ship. Let me teach you. So, the first thing that you're going to do, let me just delete that, is you want to make, this is like the first step, you want to make one of these. So basically how you make this is, first I have to turn my HUD on. Um, so you're going to want to kind of make a box on wherever your flat surface. So this could be super small to super big. So, this should be pretty, I, I'm going to make it kind of a smaller one right now. So you're just gonna make small ship, obviously, and then you're gonna um I'm just color coding this, but you can make this whatever color you want. And you're gonna hit shift control shift if you didn't know. I'm gonna make a tutorial thing tomorrow or the next day, I don't know. And you're gonna create like a platform thing that does not fill the entire thing up. And you're gonna hit control C and you're gonna do this. You can left click it wherever you want, or you can um hit escape and control V like if you really are conservative on space so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go underneath and you're gonna get um, the landing gear and you're gonna go all the way underneath and do the same thing you did the control shift left click and drag and you're gonna get these landing gears now what you want to do with these is you're gonna also put a cockpit on it and um, you're gonna put it kind of against the ground now the way you do this is you keep lowering it in until you can see the landing gears turn yellow. Once you see that, hit left click. Don't touch it as much, like, don't touch it at all. Like, just go up to it. Don't bump it or anything. Hit T. And then hit P to lock the landing gears. And then, um, you can actually end up just deleting this for right now. Because it's not going to be there. So now what we're going to do is you're going to make another block. You're going to want to go two or three layers higher if you're, if you're using big blocks just because what will end up happening uh, what will end up happening is you will sorry I'm, I'm, I'm trying to do this and it's not working with me talking that's why I'm a bad live commentator I guess I'm better at after the fact I don't know what that's called some funky name but um now what you want to do is make this so this is flush like I did this my first time and the cannon wouldn't move and I was really angry not really I was just like let's redo this so now you're gonna get a rotor which is right here you don't know um, and you're gonna place it wherever you think is the most middle so I think the middle is actually it's pretty dang close so now you're gonna once it's placed you're gonna do the same control shift you know oh if that happens you're at the wrong angle for it so if it goes all, like all the way up in your face, and I think I just mentioned this in this video, but I'm gonna make a tutorial thing just so people know. Since I did see that 250,000 copies of this game were sold, and I'm like, dang, that's a lot, like a lot of money for that guy. This guy is a genius. But um, I figured out the lag in the last video. So uh, me thinking, you know, I I have an almighty computer, which I I do. It's not as good as I thought it was though I mean it's I, I I made fraps to 120 frames a second which made a seven minute video going to like 45 gigabytes and lag the crap out of it so now you shouldn't be seeing any lag at all um, it should be perfect but um, let me just keep going cuz I, I don't wanna keep rambling so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna basically create your cannon so I'm just gonna create this cannon real fast it's gonna be really crappy just to let you know because I'm kinda hustling on time so I know this isn't gonna be very level or anything don't judge me okay so this is gonna be kind of just squarish but you can make these literally any size you want so now what you're gonna do so say you have your cannon built like like this one over here which I actually spent time on and um say this is built right but you have um you don't have like the middle section yet done yet and I'll teach you how to do that so oh and actually I'm planning on I have two hard drives just laying around there 
250 gigabytes each. Um, this thing goes right for me. I'm actually going to dedicate a hard drive just to YouTube videos. Um, yeah, and that'll make it so I can make longer videos. But um, let's get back to this. So now what you're going to want to do is if you saw me, I placed a rotor on the side. And then I basically made a wall. So now what you're going to do here is you can make this whatever shape you want, whatever. Um, you're going to need a cockpit placed on this. So a cockpit is three blocks and you're just going to place like that. So now what I did... Oh, oh, is that going to work? Oh, it worked. Nice. So this is going to be like a double type of cannon. I don't know. Um, let's make that there. Sorry if I'm going really fast. It's like, it's not late, but it is kind of late for me. I like to go to bed early just so I can sit in bed and watch TV. So now you're just going to place your actual cannons on. And there. And now you can, you know, make these level however you want. Basically, I'm leaving all of the actual details that I'd normally make in a ship out just because I'm on time, time crunch. So, the next thing you're going to need to make this thing actually turn is some gyroscopes. So, I didn't actually use that many on my um, other one. I think I only used about that many, and you're going to need a whole bunch of reactors. Normally, people will make a whole bunch of gyroscopes, but um, I like to make a whole bunch of reactors because I'm cool. Not really, I'm really probably not that cool um so after i i'm done judging myself look what we have guys we made a cannon that quick and if you see th the reason it's moving so slow is it's so big plus we added more gyros i'm just gonna randomly go around and do this oh yeah you see my skills there those are amazing see it moves a bit faster now but um, that's basically the essentials on how you build a cannon in this game. So, hope to see you guys like tomorrow. Pretty sure I'm going to post a video about just a tutorial or something. So, um, thank you guys for watching. And, yep, see you guys next video. And, wow, the lag spike at the end.